And I'm sure it's a huge part in the historical narrative of Palestine. And it's a story that you uh, make certain, all Palestinians, that the story is passed down to the next generation, lest they forget the Palestinian struggle. Sister, like for, for us, this is not history. This is a living reality. Like, we live Nakba every day. Nakba, of course, is an Arab word that means man-made catastrophe. So we survive that man-made catastrophe every single day. The criminals who implemented a military plan to eliminate Palestinian families from 532 homes are still in power and they work on the same methods of elimination. It's not that Nakba is a historic event. It's an ongoing reality imposed upon the Palestinian population by Jewish nationalists who are taking over Palestine. So for us, it's, it's impossible to forget your reality. Yes, the narrative might suggest that the ethnic cleansing of Palestine was carried out by 70,000 criminals between December 1947 and October of 1949. So some people might look at that as a historic catastrophe in the same way you would look at white savagery in South Africa during a apartheid or Nazi savagery towards like uh, Jewish people in Europe. Those are historic events. In our reality, those are not historic events. This is an ongoing process that is carried out and maintained by Jewish nationalists who commit all kinds of savagery, savage crimes towards Palestinian people from blowing people up in their homes while sleeping to demolishing people's homes, to arresting people, to restrict people's freedoms and denying them and so on and so forth. So Nakba is not a historic historic event. Nakba is a man-made catastrophe that Palestinians have been subject to for the past 75 years. Now, of course, okay. Palestinians are not being massacred by the same savages, uh, the 70,000 criminals who are the founders of the State of Israel, who are no longer being murdered by those savages, but now the government of the State of Israel honors that legacy and maintains you know, different policies that aim at maintaining the ethnic cleansing of Palestine as a policy.